I'm Bree Peterson. I play softball at Westminster. I'm a sophomore and I major in biology. Something unique about softball is that even though girls are pitching closer, they're actually pitching about the same speed as a baseball pitcher would be. And our games are a lot faster paced than a baseball game is also. <laughs> If I could have one superpower, it would be to read people's minds because I kind of feel like it would help me do better on some of my tests. The most satisfying part about my sport is that the team can accomplish something as a team and it's not something that's individual. My favorite Disney movie is Milan because a girl is actually the one that saves the whole empire. Or I think that's what it is. But, um, so it shows that a girl can do anything a guy can do, pretty much. And I, most others don't really promote that. So. I guess the thing that got me interested in playing sports is my dad. He was a coach, and he coached both of my brothers, and he made me play also. So I, I guess that's kind of how I got interested, and I was pretty good. So we, uh, we decided that it would be good if I played. <laughs> Um, the most nervous, the thing that makes me most nervous is an interview. I actually get really red and I'm not very good at them. Um, the biggest hero in my life is my mom because she holds, she kind of holds the whole family together and she just makes it easy to be myself. So. If I could have anybody play me in a movie, it would be Blake Lively, because I think she's really pretty, and she's married to Ryan Reynolds, who I have a crush on, so. <laughs> um, I guess the nerdiest thing about me is that I am really good at chemistry, and I always get the highest score on all the tests normally, so I guess that's kind of embarrassing, or nerdy if you want to say, but. I guess I have two favorite moments um, for my athletic career. One was when we won nationals when I was nine for softball at Oklahoma City. Um, we were the only team from Missouri and they said that we were a bunch of picks and we weren't going to win and we ended up winning which was kind of funny. But the second was my junior and senior year of high school. Um, we made it to sectionals for basketball in my senior year. Everybody thought we were going to state. and. Um, we ended up losing on a buzzer shot that they proved didn't go in in time, or the shot wasn't off in time, and uh, that was pretty hard, but I love my coach. She was my favorite person that's ever coached me, and my teammates were awesome, so I guess that those are two moments that I'll never forget. The last person that impressed me would be Kayla Reeg of our volleyball team. Last night I was watching her. Um, just the way she handled the situation, um, there was a point that had been going on for about two minutes maybe, and she kept throwing herself down on the ground and ended up finally scoring the point and we ended up winning, which I thought was really exciting, but I guess that's the last person that kind of impressed me. <sighs> Sadly, all the music on my iPod is from a very long time ago. I don't ever upload new music because I'm very lazy. Um, but my favorite song on my iPod is actually my walk-up song, which is Closing Time. It gets me pumped for every game, and it, it just makes me feel comfortable while I'm in the box getting ready to hit. So. What I like most about Westminster is that we're very academic-based. Um, I know a lot of other schools that my friends went to and play sports, they don't have time to go do sports and school and school's always our first priority and I really like that because in life sports really aren't going to take you past college most of the time and you need a backup plan and I think that school should always be your priority and then sports should be your backup plan.